The Earth's climate is a complex system with natural cycles shaping weather patterns across the globe. One such powerful phenomenon is La Nina. But what is La Nina? How does it occur? And why does it matter to us? La Nina, Spanish for the girl, is a weather pattern driven by interactions between the atmosphere and the Pacific Ocean. It's part of a larger system called the El Nino Southern Oscillation, or ENSO, which alternates between warm El Nino, neutral, and cold La Nina phases. La Nina occurs when trade winds, winds that blow east to west across the equatorial Pacific, become stronger than usual. These winds push warm surface water toward the western Pacific, allowing colder water from the depths to rise to the surface in the eastern Pacific, near South America. This cooling of surface waters disrupts global weather patterns by altering atmospheric pressure systems. As a result, La Nina influences rainfall, temperatures, and storm activity around the world. La Nina is a game changer for weather systems. Its effects vary across continents. In some areas, it brings torrential rains and flooding, while in others, it triggers droughts. Here's how La Nina impacts different parts of the world. Australia and Southeast Asia experience increased rainfall, leading to floods. North America witnesses cooler winters in the Northwest and drier conditions in the Southern US. South America faces droughts in regions like Brazil, affecting agriculture. Africa. Eastern Africa often sees wetter conditions, while Southern Africa may suffer from dryness. India. La Nina typically strengthens the monsoon, bringing more rain than usual. In India, La Nina's influence is most visible during the monsoon season. The stronger trade winds enhance moisture flow from the Indian Ocean, resulting in heavier and more consistent rains. This is a boon for agriculture, particularly for water-intensive crops like rice and sugarcane. La Nina is also linked to extreme weather events. For instance, it can fuel stronger hurricanes in the Atlantic due to reduced wind shear, while simultaneously increasing the intensity of tropical cyclones in the Pacific. Meanwhile, La Nina contributes to colder winters in parts of North America and Europe as jet streams shift due to the cooling Pacific waters. La Nina doesn't just disrupt weather, it also affects ecosystems and economies. Prolonged droughts can devastate agriculture in South America, while flooding in Asia can destroy infrastructure and displace millions. Too much rain during La Nina damaged our crops, we struggled to recover our losses. Marine ecosystems also feel the effects. The cooler waters of La Nina increase nutrient levels, benefiting fisheries in the Eastern Pacific, but altering global fish migration patterns. Monitoring La Nina requires advanced technology. Scientists use satellite imagery, ocean buoys, and climate models to track sea surface temperatures and wind patterns. While La Nina is a natural cycle, its intensity and frequency may be influenced by climate change. Warmer ocean temperatures and changing wind patterns could amplify La Nina's effects. By understanding phenomena like La Nina, we can better navigate the rhythms of nature and safeguard our future.